More phones are ringing more often at local ERs, clinics, and call centers. Health workers say a lot of people are worried about the swine flu, but they also say this is a time to prepare, not panic. Fox 11's Lindsay Vermis has our story. You won't see a difference at the diamond. It hasn't left a mark on the crowd or even slowed the swing. But there's no denying swine flu worries are here. My life day to day hasn't been affected, but it's in the back of your mind, certainly. Concerns didn't stop Andy Grabau from catching his daughter's game, but like many, he's got a lot of questions and is trying to play it smart. Um, the unknowns, it's... Uh, a little scary. Area doctors say that uncertainty is driving the rush of calls now hitting Nurse Direct, clinics and hospitals like Mercy Medical Center in Oshkosh. With uh, any sort of outbreak, uh, call numbers increase because people are concerned. Mercy is seeing more callers, but patient visits have stayed the same. Dr. Mark Kerberg says most flu concerns can be handled on the phone, but some symptoms make physicians anxious. Primarily respiratory problems, difficulty breathing, shortness of breath. Um, some people talk about blue lips. Oshkosh Health Director Paul Spiegel says the health department is also seeing more calls. Staff members are reaching out to schools and businesses to spread a message of prevention. You don't have to panic, but it certainly is something you may want to start being prepared for. Prepared for school closure or daycare closures or uh, a, a workforce adjustments. Spiegel says the department is testing those who have respiratory symptoms, a connection to an area with confirmed cases, and have developed those symptoms within seven days of returning from that area. The city had one suspect case of swine flu. That case turned out negative. But with other suspect cases being tested in the Fox Valley, Spiegel says we haven't seen the end. My gut feeling is it's it's not a matter of if, it's just a matter of when. Lindsay Veramis, Fox 11 News. And Spiegel says typically the state would handle all the sample testing, but with so many possible cases of swine flu, local health departments will also be assisting. The worry about the swine flu